Welcome back to the Hollywood News Channel, where we update you with the latest news of the day. Hello, everyone, and welcome back. Ivanka Trump was only eight years old when her father left her mother. Ivana from Marla Maples, a scandal of Trump proportions. And Ivanka was fiercely close to her mother during the divorce, which might provide clues as to why there's no love lost on her end. Ivanka and Marla have differing views of their relationship, as Marla recalls being close to her stepdaughter Ivanka, but Ivanka views it differently. So here's how their relationship developed over the years. Marla Maples was the other woman. During what may have been considered a midlife crisis, Donald Trump dumped Ivanka's mother for Marla Maples, Newsweek reported. Not only did Trump leave his first wife Ivana, sources said he was neglecting his three children, Ivanka, Donald Jr. and Eric. And Ivana was too busy with her children and helping to run the Trump empire to notice that her husband went astray. Media wanted to know what Ivanka thought of her father's sex life. Young Ivanka was asked to comment on a New York Post headline about the best sex her father had with Marla, Vanity Fair reported. At the time, Ivanka was only nine years old and wrote, one idiot reporter even had the temerity to ask me if Marla Maple's claims were true. What type of person would ask a nine-year-old girl that kind of question? The divorce was hard on Ivanka. According to Ivanka, Ivanka was crying and upset all the time. Cosmopolitan featured this quote from Ivana saying, The children are all wrecks. Ivanka now comes home from school crying. Mommy, does it mean I'm not going to be Ivanka Trump anymore? Little Eric asks me, is it true you're going away and not coming back? Ivanka did not attend her father's wedding to Marla. Ivanka gained a stepmother but did not attend the wedding, according to Vanity Fair. The children said they prefer to stay at home with their mother rather than attend the nuptials, the New York Daily News reported. Marla recently posted a throwback photo with the Trump girls. Marla Maple shared an old photo of her posing with a young Tiffany and her teenage sister Ivanka in Telluride, Colorado. The caption said, appreciating moments with these two special girls along with hashtag sister love, the Daily Mail reported. The trio looks happy and carefree in the image as they were likely on a ski vacation together. Ivanka sees her relationship with Marla differently. Despite the sunny image Marla posted, Ivanka insists she and Marla are not close. People magazine asked Ivanka whether she and Marla were tied, and she responded, I'm not, she was out in California and really my relationship is with Tiffany. Ivanka and Tiffany appeared to be close. Despite comments about Marla, Ivanka seems to truly love and share a bond with her younger stepsister Tiffany. Although Tiffany was raised in California, Ivanka told people, she's my little sister, I've been close to Tiffany her whole life and I really love her. Marla wants to make up. Surprisingly, Marla told people she wants to make up with Ivana. After more than two decades, she's ready to extend an olive branch and make peace with her ex-husband's first wife. However, Ivana is not ready to let bygones be bygones. Marla asked to apologize to me in the Daily Mail in London. They asked if I accepted the apology and I said no. Why should I? She broke my marriage, Ivana said to the New York Post. Ivana has moved on. Ivana says she and Donald are now on good terms. She mentioned in a CBC Sunday morning interview that she and the president speak once a week. She also said she has encouraged him to continue using Twitter. Furthermore, Ivana said she was offered the post of ambassador to the Czech Republic where she was born, but turned the offer down saying she already has a perfect life. Melania thinks of herself as Ivanka's friend. Melania revealed a glimpse of how she views her relationship with her stepchildren to Harper's Bazaar in 2016. They are grown up, I don't see myself as their mother, she said. I'm their friend and I'm here when they need me. Ivanka thanked Melania for her support and friendship in her most recent book, Women Who Work. She also said the first lady had a heart of gold, so there is solid evidence that the two were on good terms. They've experienced their fair share of tension. According to Vanity Fair, two sources close to Ivanka and Melania in the fashion and media industries observed the frostiness between the two. No one elaborated on what could have caused the tension between the two. Some speculated Ivanka playing the first lady during Melania's absence from the White House could have caused the affirmation of frostiness, while others called Ivanka's role in the White House a clear obligation. Their relationship is fine. Another source told Vanity Fair their relationship is fine. Melania's communications director, Stephanie Grisham, vouched that Ivanka and Ms. Trump have always shared a close relationship and that continues today. While we don't have extensive evidence of the statement, a 2012 Huffington Post blog offered similar insight. Nicole Brill, Melania's former makeup artist, wrote, All the Trumps are quite family dedicated, actually. 
they're a seriously close-knit family. Ivanka has called Melania an inspiration. Ivanka called Melania an unbelievable mother and offered her praise for the first lady's ability to balance parenting and politics. It's pretty uncommon for wives of candidates to not be on the campaign trail every day. And she made a decision I totally respect. My father's traveling so frequently, and she's an unbelievably consistent, loving and reliable figure in Baron's life, Ivanka told people. She takes Baron to school every day, picks him up every day. It's a really remarkable thing, and she's a great inspiration to me as I raise my own children in terms of family first and having the right priorities. It's probably complicated. Every mother-daughter relationship is multifaced. Sometimes great, sometimes horrible. Factor in two ex-wives, stepchildren, a divisive political climate, and throw it all into the White House, and complicated probably doesn't even begin to cover it. We can analyze the official and candid photographs of the two, dissect their every interaction, and keep hoping for a tell-all interview. But for the time being, complicated may be as good an explanation as we can get. Thank you so much for joining us, and see you next time. Bye! Last one. <sighs> Thank you for watching the Hollywood News. Don't forget to like and share the updates to the latest information of the day.